Right, it's so the second go at this. I was doing it a minute ago and the, I thought, fire alarm went off. What the dickens? What, you know, there is, they do test the fire alarm in the week, but not on a Friday when they play in that. And it's, I don't know, it seems this week, it seems, I don't know. Um, don't know, I think the, the, I've got the technical gremlins this week. You know, it, they, it keeps seem to cut off and, um, yeah. But anyway, I was... Um, what I was saying about was um, I was in two minds this week. I've got there's a there's a big ultra marathon in Ely, which is just down the road from me, and um, on Sunday, and I was in two minds whether to do it or not. And um, my mind's been made up really because um, it starts I think at seven thirty or eight o'clock in the morning. It's quite you know early start because it's you know it's going to it would take quite a few hours and then six sixty sixty eight kilometers and I've never run that far before anyway so I was I was to and fro about it. And um you know I mean Ely is only sort of well it's about thirteen or fourteen miles down well from here, about thirteen or fourteen miles away. And had it been a half marathon or a marathon, I probably would have just jumped on the bike and cycled there. But um I thought ultra marathon is a little bit more of a a little bit more challenging, and um, anyway, so I thought, well, I'll get, I, I, you know, being an eco warrior, I'll get, I'll get the bus or the train, and I looked at the bus times and the train times, and each one wouldn't have got me there until after nine o'clock in the morning, so not a lot of use there. Well, I've got a oh, one of these zip car cards, you know, that I paid for earlier, right? Bit silly, really. I've never used it, and the, the you know what for what I was going to get it for, uh, I wasn't going to be able to use it anyway. But that's another that's another story. And um, yeah, you know when I when I looked into it, you know like to to get a zip car from well, I had to have had it from half six in the morning from here, uh, take it to Ely and then back. It would have cost me sixty five quid. Well, that's, I mean, that's, that's an all. I mean, it's only just down the road. Um, so I thought, well, okay, think again. And um, so I just had the bright idea. I thought, oh, I want you know, a taxi. You know, can't be that much to get a taxi or Ely. 50 quid. 50 quid. And uh, half a ton, I thought, oh, no. So I've decided now that's it. That's you know. Anyway, I put I put something on Facebook about you know anyone, you know, because I've got to be in Ely that evening anyway. Because um, I'm doing a what we call a Rupert Bear or a share at the um, at the Sunday evening meeting of Ely AA, and um, basically what that means is I I rock along there and I, I basically I tell my story about my you know my experience my experience when I was drinking. You know what it was like, uh, what happened, and what it's like now. You know, so my experience, they call it new experience strength and hope, really. And um, yeah, so I'd agree to do that anyway because I thought well, I'm going to be an Ely. Um, but but lots, like, so I haven't got a car, so I just put something like out as a flyer on Facebook. You know, anyone, anyone from you know AA is going to Ely if they want to give me a lift, and a couple of friends of mine are going to take me. Uh, that'd be nice because we're good, all good mates, and that'd be we haven't sort of done anything like that for a long time, so I'm quite looking forward to that. Um, yeah, but uh, yeah, so that's good. And yeah, I've just got back from a run, and it's been a it's been a nice thing. it's been a nice run. I had quite a long one, I was out for nearly two hours, and um, yeah, it's uh. It's yeah, it's been a good day. Yeah, very good day. And um yeah, I've got the uh, <coughs> next week is a busy week. I've got um well, you know, I like keep saying it's my birthday next week and then the week after I'm starting I'm starting this um insanity course on that'll be on the on the Wednesday and the Friday. Um I'm looking for other locations as well, so I can do a few more. I do, you know, it'd be nice to do, you know, like some in the evening time as well, so you know, the fellas who are working can do it. And um, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm big. I'm a big fan of insanity, so I, I kind of want to spread the word of it anyway. I think it's a, you know, a brilliant thing. And um, you know, and it, 
it's, yeah, it's just it just seems like everything sort of coming together at the moment, which is really quite nice. Um, you know, but you know, it's it's the way it goes. Sometimes, sometimes, sometimes you're up, sometimes you're down. And, you know, those of you who've been watching this on a daily basis will see it. I'll go up and down with a regularity of, of Tower Bridge. Yeah, there's a couple of funny things that was out. You know, mate, you know, I was out for a run. And it was, uh, I was running along, and there's a, there a couple of old ladies like walking along. Love the old ladies, and um, and so I sort of ran past a smile, got them and said good morning, and uh, one of them said, "Oh, well done." She said, "I've been out for mine already." <laughs> she said, <laughs> "Bless her, that you know that that made me chuckle." And it reminded me of a few weeks ago. I was running along by the river, and uh, I saw these two geezers on the other side of the river fishing. And I thought, I don't know, that they, I recognised them, but I reckon I kind of recognised them as being sort of like, um, I don't know, being perhaps a bit dodgy characters. And uh, I, th I thought, you know, I, I, they, they looked like I might have slung them out of my pub when I was running my pub or something like that, you know. But they, I thought I'd cross swords with them somewhere along the line. And as I was going along, one of them shouted across the river, Oh, bloody hell, he said, I thought you were dead. He said, you still at it? He said, you must be 90 at least. Oh, it just made me laugh. I was just I, I was just chuckling all the way home from that. That was just absolutely brilliant, you know. And it's it's it is a lovely thing with, with the running. It just seems to, I don't know, people, for the most part, you know, I mean, you get a few people who sort of, you know, like people who try and run you off the road and people who sort of like not very pleasant to you but for the most part it just seems to bring out a nice thing in people you know especially things like the London Marathon and the humour that I, I come across is absolutely wonderful you know so um, yeah you know I mean it's like last Friday when it was absolutely bucketing down I was running along and there's another lad running along in the other direction and it, you know we were both absolutely soaked and we just looked at each other we didn't even need to say anything we both just started you know sort of grinning at each other we just thought oh we must both be bloody mad and anyway so uh yeah i think i'll leave it there and uh, a bit rambly today but at least it didn't cut off so that's a bonus so um yeah i'll speak to you again tomorrow okay cheers then bye-bye have a nice weekend if i don't see you